Hi friends, this is Abijah Baker. I'm Maria and I feel awfully short. <laughs> Shorter. <clears throat> Today I'm going to show you how to make um, mayonnaise, homemade mayonnaise. <sighs> I know, don't don't huff yet because if you've never had homemade mayonnaise, um, you have been missing out. It's so easy. It's so easy. I'm doing mine with an immersion blender, which is as easy as it gets. Uh, with the others by hand you had to whisk it and keep that emulsifying going until it was all done and that was a long hard <gasps> workout I'm I'm not into that right now uh, this and everything goes in together at once and then the emulsifier does all the work Ooh, the flavor boy the flavor is top-notch it's it's better than anything you can so I'm going to lower the camera and Um, emulsifier is going to be going in and out and that's the that's the step you want it to do that's what's going to do all the work for you so you've got an egg mustard I know mustard and mayonnaise what I know but but you need it and you've got I am using white pepper um, honestly because I have it and I like using it um, garlic salt white vinegar and the juice of eh, let's see if I were to say how much it is maybe maybe a tablespoonish of fresh lemon and then vegetable oil you can use any kind of oil you like sorry I, where are you I'm trying to tilt you you can use any kind of oil olive oil is a pretty heavy oil um, keep that in mind canola oil you can switch canola and avocado or whatever combination you like and then that's it that's it now I'm starting it all the way in the bottom all the way in the bottom and I'm just going to pulse it. Now this is a slow process and I'm going to take my time. Like I say, I'm in no hurry. I'm in no hurry to get this done because I'd rather it's done right. I can feel how thick it is, which is good. So thick that is creamy Yum. Is so good look at that that is thick you guys you have got to try this it's it's kind of fun creamy oh, 
smells amazing. Easy, right? Really. Look at how thick that is. That is so... Ooh. Kind of good. Man, this is, this is a topper. All that from one egg. I would use a little less mustard, but on a sandwich, when you use mustard anyways, this is perfect. Deviled eggs, if you're already going to use mustard, that's a perfect amount. Oh my God, that is, okay, I got to go eat. <laughs> I'm going to go make a sandwich. That's it. That's, that's homemade mayonnaise. You've got most of the stuff at home, I'm certain. You guys got to try it. Just, just give it a try. If, if you don't like it, there's always Best Foods. So, and I'm not knocking Best Foods. I grew up on it. That's because I never had this. All right, my friends. Until next time. Happy baking. Ah, that was fun. Don't forget to like and subscribe.